you know, Lisa was only four and a half when I first met her, and cognizant memory doesn't really kick in until you're about four and a half, five years old. The things, if you look back on your life, you don't remember much until then. So I think that all of her memories of Christmas when she was a little girl with her daddy um, definitely included me. So I played Santa Claus to her. <laughs> I played the Easter Bunny for her. And um, I, I just, I loved her so dearly. She was the sweetest little girl. You know, um, I know that I've seen interviews since where she says she was a little hellion and she was, a, you know, a terror at Graceland. I never experienced that. For me, she was like a little blonde cherub, you know, a little angel. Um, she was always very loving. Elvis loved her immeasurably and showed that love. He demonstrated that love to her just very generously. You know, he, we called her little goober nickel. We had all these little pet names for her. And, you know, he was very attentive and very tuned into her. And um, you, you were talking about how much Riley looks like Lisa on, on certain angles and how much Lisa looked like her daddy. I'll tell you a funny story. She was at um, my birthday party one year, and she said, Linda, come to the restroom with me, as women do. You know, I said, okay. So I'm in the restroom with her, and we're talking, and we're in close proximity to each other. And I'm looking at her eyes, and I said, okay, Lisa, you're either going to have to kiss me on the lips, or we got to get out of here. You, you look so much like your daddy right now. It was like looking into Elvis's eyes when I looked into her eyes. So she went, ew. <laughs> And we laughed and went back to my birthday party. But, um, you know, I'm, I'm so grateful that I got to share so many incredible times with her and, more importantly, so much love. It occurs to me that the only thing we really take with us when we go is love. And the only thing we leave of real, true value is love when we, when we go. So she's left that here. All of you are here because you loved her, you loved her daddy. We're here because we love her and love her daddy. So it's, it's, um, it's kind of comforting to know that the love still lives on. You know, the body may be gone, but the love